Helping tonight a desperate search for a missing college student. Jasmine Moody disappeared while visiting a friend in Detroit. This was nearly a year ago. She was in town on break from the University of Texas. Jasmine's family believes someone out there knows where she is. 7 Action News reporter Tara Edwards live on the city's east side with more on the efforts to find her. Tara. Well, that's right. It's been almost a year and the family still has no answers and no closure because they still don't know what happened to their girl, but they say they are not giving up. I miss my child and I need her home dead or alive. A family desperate to find their missing daughter, Jasmine Moody, and a major hunt is underway. Three seasoned detectives, two from Detroit, one from the state police, members of the Marcus Garvey movement and Crime Stoppers, all working together to solve a crime. Last December, the Texas college student was visiting a Detroit woman she had developed a long-term internet relationship with. According to investigators, the woman indicated the pair had a fight over a Facebook page. Then she says Jasmine left the house and was never seen again. I have sleepless nights. I lock myself in the closet sometimes. I cry. I yell, I scream. When we tried to speak to Brittany Gurley, the woman who Jasmine was visiting, Brittany and Jasmine's family got into an argument. Cars pulling up in the, on our block, and they sit I there. I do and too, sweetie. Every we day, have other children. Jasmine's family frustrated with the limited information they are getting from Brittany and her family. Investigators and family members believe someone out there knows where Jasmine is. In a grassroots effort, they're passing out flyers and searching this neighborhood along the 3,000 block of Baldwin on Detroit's east side, searching for clues. She got a grandmother that's very sick, very, very sick, and she she cleaned it to life, trying to wait on her granddaughter. Oh, she trying to wait. <laughs> she trying to wait. People don't just disappear into thin air. Crime Sappers is offering a $2,500 reward for any information that leads to an arrest. And remember, calls are anonymous. Live on Detroit's East Side, Tara Edwards, 7 Action News.